This video is about viruses in the Paramyxoviridae family. Human diseases that are caused by these viruses include measles, mumps, and croup. This is an image of the virus particle, which is also known as a virion. Viruses in the Paramyxoviridae family are single-stranded minus sense RNA viruses. After the virus gets into its host, it uses the host's organelles to make viral proteins. The virus encodes for its own transcriptase, which lets it make a plus sense RNA strand that can in turn that that in turn can be translated by the host cell's ribosomes. Viral proteins also get embedded into the host cell's plasma membrane, which will eventually become the envelope for the new virus particles, also known as virions. The virus does not enter the host cell's nucleus. Instead, it does all of its work in the cytoplasm. The life cycle of the virus includes budding from the host cell. There are viral proteins put in the plasma membrane of the host. The plasma membrane becomes the coating for the virus. When you get images from the internet to put in your own presentation of your virus, be careful. Even if the image is in the Creative Commons, it does not mean the image was drawn correctly. This is an example of what would otherwise be a great illustration of a virion that causes measles, except that it shows what? The RNA should be single-stranded. It is showing the RNA is being double-stranded. To be drawn correctly, the RNA should just be a single strand of nucleotides. Measles viruses are highly contagious. Achoo! The symptoms that we can see for people infected with the measles, with measles include red, irritated eyes, coplic spots are white spots in the mouth, and or a skin rash. The rash usually appears three to five days after the first signs of being sick. It may last from four to seven days. It usually starts at the head and moves down the body. The rash may appear as flat discolored areas and as solid red raised areas that later join together. The rash is also itchy. Inside the body, the cells are overtaken by the virus. This is an image from a piece of infected tissue. What is characteristic of the measles pneumonia are the large cells that have several intercytoplasmic inclusions. So how do you get better? Rest, take in lots of fluids, stay warm. You may want to see a doctor because measles is very serious. Antibiotics do not work on viruses. If, however, you have a secondary infection, you will definitely want to see a doctor so he or she can prescribe antibiotics for you. Antibiotics work to kill bacteria that may have seen you as an opportunity to become their new home. Why doesn't everybody get measles? Because we're vaccinated. The MMR shot we get as babies is for mumps, measles, and rubella, also known as German measles. Thank you for watching the video. Remember, wash your hands with warm, soapy water often. Have a great day.